Yo, 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 what's up, everybody? We are back with Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, and I know you're excited for the next part in the segment. We are on part 16. We just beat the Giga Trice boss, and now we're back with Clyde and the gang, and we're pushing forward, we're progressing forward into the story. Let's get it. Take the lead, you ready? Switch the track here. Do you think the others are gonna be okay? These tracks seem about ready to fall apart. I have a feeling they'll hold for a while yet. You do? Of course. I'm standing on guard. Wait, I've read about this.
At the next inn, we treat you to a foot massage. Yo, the music sounds like something from Top Gun. Cloud! It's crazy. What's our route looking like? Do what I could. Should be fine. Are you sure? Like, really sure? <laughs> Thanks for that. Sit tight. You'll be down soon. Only way out is through. So buckle up, buttercup.
You okay? Uh, better than I thought, actually. Guess Cloud didn't feel like completely screwing us over. <laughs> what a letdown. Still alive? Miraculously, yeah. Wallace has graced us with this presence. Hmm? Surprised you had the balls to come back, but we're so glad you did. <laughs> <laughs> training if you hope to face me. 
Look at you, all in pieces. Sure wish we could go to work again, like the good old boy. Where do you get off drinking all my booze? Maybe that's why I joined the watch. Don't tell me! Get rich quick scheme blow up in your face again? Try to sell out another town, huh? Don't let him talk to you like that. I can take it. Been out of work for when you're hungry. Remember? I trust you ain't just window shopping. Hurry it up, would ya? Welcome to North Corral. The coal mining industry here was the largest employer and backbone of the local community, but everything changed with the advent of Mako. As you can see, this village is a casualty of progress.
You're up. With me. You owe me one. Buzz off. Analyzing one's failures can prove instructive. Needless to say, many hazards await you on the road, so take care. worked up is all. Wait, do you play Queen's Blood? Rolf gets really excited whenever he senses a skilled player nearby. You may find this hard to believe, but he's the world's only T9 competitor. And he's pretty good, too. <laughs> he's saying he wants to go around with you. Well, you game? Well, come back if you ever want to play. No, no, keep chewing, okay? Get your free rations. Take it from me. 
Take whatever beds are open. It's time you moved on. the joy of the piano to every corner of the world. Would you care to share a performance with me? I regret that I've nothing to award you at this time. Nevertheless, I trust you will continue on your musical journey. Such a badass that even Beck and his bitches couldn't handle me. Kick me out of their stupid little gang. That's right. You're standing face to face with the legendary Biff. You shaking in your boots yet? Oh, uh, tough guy, huh? Respect. But it seems to me like we got no choice but to settle this with a game of Queen's Blood. And if I whoop your ass, you gotta give me three, no, seven whole kill. That was too easy. Oh, how can I lose? Uh, 
want to know a secret? Truth is, I bailed from the bandit life because I just couldn't hack it. So I... I figured I'd turn over a new leaf and become a Queen's Blood player instead, but turns out no good at that neither. You gotta tell me, what's the trick, man? How do I get your kind of skills? What, don't like handing out free advice or something? Only a real cheapskate would charge for that shit, asshole. Well, better hang on to that gill of yours, cause next time we meet, I'ma take seven off you for sure. What are you? Just like you said. Keep them coming. Coming out on top this month. Yeah, we got this in the bag. Heard through the grapevine the Well, I'll be. Oh, we got the same <laughs> Ralph says that he'd love to play with you. But you got to admit, he's pretty good, right? Amazing, even. Rolf is actually scheduled to make his television debut. They're doing a special on animals who can play Queen's Blood. And once we get famous, we can finally kiss this town goodbye. We got this. Right, Rolf? <laughs> Someone I want to see. 
When I got hurt back in Nibelheim, they brought me to this clinic. The doctor here, Sheeran, he's the one who saved my life. Oh. You're telling me Doc Sheeran's the one who fixed you up? Come on. Do not be deceived. You know the truth. Trust in me. Sephiroth! <laughs> the hell's gotten into you, man. What's going on? Barrett Wallace. Dr. Sheeran. It's... it's been a while. <laughs> Certainly has. <laughs> That's one frightening-looking appendage you got there. But hey, at least you still seem to have your health. Yeah, and you too. Oh, I'm feeling the miles, but the work keeps me trucking. I tell you what, though. Do you remember me? Well, of course I do, Tifa. But it hasn't been that long. You heal up all right? I did, yeah. I just wanted to drop by and say thank you. If it wasn't for you, I doubt I'd be standing here today. Don't thank me. Thank Lady Luck and Shinra for that helicopter. I'm sorry, Shinra? I know you might find it hard to believe. But not all the apples in that bunch are rotten. But seriously, you're living proof of the good in people. Don't ever forget that. It'd be a pity to let their kindness go to waste. Yeah. Besides, you need to set a good example for your friends here. Oh, right. Well, I gotcha. Mind helping me out? Need to draw that gentleman's blood. You think you can hold him still for me? <clears throat> At first, I thought it was just Mako poisoning. It is until I ran some tests. The results were strange. Strange how? A substance turned up. One I've never seen before. Not sure what to make of it yet, but it did remind me of one I have seen. Your eyes. Soldier, right? X, soldier. It's not a job, son. Once a soldier, always a soldier. Ha! Huh. Spare a drop? No. Yeah. I ask, because I suspect there's soldiers suffering from cellular degradation. Just a theory for now. And one I can't prove, not without a lot more testing. You see many of these guys come through? Yeah, and then some. I do what I can for the injured ones, but leave the rest to stumble onto the saucer. Why would they go there? Shit. <laughs> Don't ask me. I think it's odd too. <laughs> Ain't that something? The girl I saved coming back here with Barrett of all people. I'm sure there's some kind of cosmic significance to that, but hell if I know what it is. <laughs> If there's one thing you can count on... Dr. Sheeran's been distributing meals to the people in town. Mining days. So... Tuck mentioned the gold saucer, right? As in the amusement park? Where every day is a holiday? We're going, right? I mean, we have to! Yuffie, this isn't a vacation. Yeah, yeah. Weird mumbling guys, got it. Oh man, this is gonna be so much fun! Town's got a ropeway that'll take us straight there. It's not far. If we're doing this, let's just do it. In four years. Sorry! I'm sorry! I promise I'll do it right next time! Just don't hit me! Hey, 
Wait, deep breaths. The boss is here. No one's gonna hurt you. Yes. This will take us all the way to the salsa. Hey, you can't let those assholes talk to you like that. We should go back and uh, beat him up or something. Practically, the whole damn town came out to crap on him. Someone tell me why I'm the only one who's pissed here. <sighs> I told you. I can take it. Think you could at least tell us what it was all about? They were talking like you sold them out for money, but... I know that isn't true. That's not you. So how'd they get it so wrong? Where the hell is it? This about her? About Marlene? with decent coal. Decent folks, too. Rough around the edges, but big hearts, salt of the earth. And I sold them all down the river. Took away their future and their hope. Sud and poor as dirt, but none of that mattered. We had friends and family, and that was enough. Till we learned about the miracle of Mako and all we'd been missing out on. And then we just had to have a taste. <laughs> so now only Dine is opposed. Damn right I am. We can't just abandon the mines. Not after our fathers and grandfathers risked their lives to maintain them. I hear you, Dine. I do. But nobody sees any future in coal. So I ask you, why break our backs working harder and harder when we're taking home less year after year? <sighs> if I may, sir. Once the reactor is complete, a portion of the revenue will go to the town. Your community will be preserved, or enriched, I should say. Listen, man. This is your chance to give your daughter a better life than what we had. You think I haven't thought about that? Come on. Are we gonna let some city slickers tell us our coal is worthless? We gonna let him tell us we're worthless? It would seem we've reached an impasse. In which case, any further discussion would be a waste of breath. So, Mr. Mayor, shall we put it to a vote?
everyone was ecstatic, convinced it was the dawn of a new era. Then one day... <clears throat> the reactor exploded. Y'all saw the aftermath. how it's gonna be. Listen, I don't want your sympathy or your pity. You can keep all of that nonsense. I did what I did, and I can live with it. Right. We gotta shake this off. We're about to rock up to the funnest place ever. The Gold Saucer! Huh? So turn those rounds upside down. <laughs> what in the hell? Ain't no one but you thinking about how much fun we're gonna have. Right? Wanna have a look? It's coming up over there. <sighs> Glad to see we're all on the same page. guys i think i'm going to stop here i hope you guys enjoyed this portion of final fantasy 7 rebirth thank you all for tuning in and stay tuned for the next one and if you haven't seen the previous video you know what to do check the bottom of the screen and click that button and don't forget to subscribe thank you guys peace